cooking up a storm in our kitchen this morning because we are loving the fact that we're celebrating Heritage Month on Expresso Show and we're making a recipe today that's very integral to South African society. Now, of course, we've got one thing, pancakes, and we've got milk tart, but we're bringing them together in a mouth-wateringly delicious recipe, Caitlin Williams style. Ooh, good morning. morning, how are you? <laughs> like, only you can do it, sister friend. Well, it's a good morning with pancakes, always. I know. Milk tart pancakes. Yes. I never heard of it in my life. My little culinary concoction. Really? <laughs> yeah, so I thought about, you know, pancakes with cinnamon sugar, so South African, and yes. so is milk tart. Yeah. And, you know, you can't go wrong by mixing the two. I love it. This is going to take the world by storm, so you need to take this down because it's going to be fantastic. <laughs> How do we start this recipe? Okay, so let's start with the pancakes. So I've got some water in here. We're going to be using our Sasko pancake quick treats mix today. Yeah. And super, super easy. Yeah. You, everyone needs to keep one of these in their, in their cupboard for those last minute kind of yeah. moments when friends come around and it's a rainy day like today in Cape yes. Town. And so we've got some egg in here, a little bit of oil. And then we're going to put in our quick treats. Simple as that, there just whisk go. everything together. I love the quick treats because it makes everything so easy. There's no having to measure and mix. Exactly. Everything is right there in the bag for you. So just mix it until there's no lumps, and then you're going to let this mix just stand okay. for about an hour all because right. you've now you've you've mixed it and all the gluten has kind of gone a little bit um, crazy. So you just want that to relax. All right. And then it's going it's also going to thicken a little bit like this. Nice. So I'm just going to do a swap over, and then we've got a hot pan over here. Okay. So I've greased it, and um, just I always use just a little bit of um, oil and a, a like kitchen towel and okay. I just do that or you can use some you know uh, cooking spray if you want and then I'm gonna pour some in here so a very hot pan and then we're oh, gonna swirl it around that. and remember if your first one flops yeah it's not an issue that is it's standard okay every chef even the best chef really first pancakes flop I don't feel so bad anymore. The first <laughs> 10 of mine usually flop, no, and then the last one is just perfect. That's what we call the chef's share. <laughs> that's the one that you enjoy in the kitchen where no one else is looking. So now we're gonna do the milk tart filling. Okay. So we've got some uh, Sasko cake flour here. So the milk tart is just the, the normal standard one that you would have, you know, in a, in a milk tart crust. And we've got some milk. Yeah. So I'm just gonna stir this together. And we're gonna, it's basically a sweet white sauce. Oh, really? For all intents and purposes. And so you're just gonna add all that in, and we're gonna make a paste. Okay. And we've got some milk simmering over there. I see, so with, with a, a cinnamon stick. stick. Cinnamon in because there, yeah. It's not milk tart and it's not pancakes without, without cinnamon. Without the cinnamon. So we're just gonna make a paste, and then you always ha add hot to cold. All right. You want to just loosen the edges of the pancake okay, for me, please? Loosen for us. I must tell you, I've never, ever, ever made a milk tart, or at least a filling, before. Do I flop the... Do I... Yes, flip it. Oh, oh, no. I don't no, know no, if no, I... No, 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 What are you going to do? Come. Oh, my word. Caitlin, how can you do this to me? Do it. Oh, yay! She fantastic. She can be taught. Lovely. Fantastic. I love that. So now I'm putting this back in a saucepan, and we're going to put it back on the heat. Okay. Just swap that over. Just swap that. And now you're gonna cook it until it's nice and thick. Right. And then we've got some vanilla in here. Put a flavor and a little dash of cinnamon. Some, some more cinnamon. You can never have enough cinnamon no, in your life. No, of course not. And then you're just gonna stir it until it's nice and thick, that yeah. flour cooks out, and it gets into a beautiful sort of nice consistency. Is that it? That's it. What? I so thought now it was more intricate than I've that. I've got the Fantastic. filling here. Okay. Um, this one's a little bit thick, actually. Okay. But it will taste perfect. Right. And so, your beautiful pancake. I'm going Aww, to flip it out. I look at her, she's so hands, cute. Hands of steel. I love that. And then we're going to spread some of the filling on. And then you can put some cinnamon sugar okay. if you want. Um, but I've made some cinnamon crumbles to kind of replicate the oh, crust of a milk tart. Nice. And so, of course yeah. it gives it the different variations in terms of the texture as well, hey? Absolutely. So this is, I mean, this is just Crunch. flour and butter and sugar and cinnamon, like kind of rubbed together. Nice. But if you want a shortcut, you can use um, crumbled biscuits. That would also work fabulously. I love it. Some extra cinnamon sugar. While you're doing that, if you would like our recipe this morning for our milk tart pancakes, all you have to do is SMS the word SASCO to 33728. We'll send you your pick and pay shopping list and the link to the recipe. And you could be making this delicious, oh so South African treat yourself. It looks fantastic and I'm sure you could pop some cream or some ice cream on it. It would just round it off so, so perfectly. But it's perfect on its and, own, right? And there you go.
wow. milk tart pancakes. Mm, mm, mm. Well done. And of course, this is this is your yeah, kind this, of. This was my. Uh, I don't know. I love combining two random desserts and making something extra decadent. Ta da! <laughs> well, it looks so amazing. Once again, that keyword is Sasco. SMS it to 33728. We'll send you your pick and pay shopping list and the link to the recipe. Boys, I know that you're about to tell us about our cruise, cruise deal of the week. I don't know if you can find this where you guys are going, though. <laughs> Let's go quick treats, oh so easy and delicious.